This video will demonstrate how the Radiant One VDS can be used to build a hierarchical virtual view based on relationships existing in a database. The database schema used in this demo contains two tables, people and project. There is a relationship between the two tables based on project ID. The purpose of this demonstration is to build a hierarchical virtual view showing projects followed by a sublevel containing the people associated with the project. The configuration steps include extracting the schema from the database and then building the desired virtual view based on the existing relationship. The schema manager tool is used to extract the schema from the database. The first step is to enter the connection information to reach the database server. This includes the server name, port, database name, as well as a user and password. Once the connection is established, the desired tables must be selected. The metadata is saved into an XML-based configuration file and will later be used as a basis for modeling the virtual view. After the extraction process, the schema file is displayed in the schema manager. In this example, the relationship existing between the tables is implicit and therefore was not discovered during the schema extraction. The schema manager tool is used to define the needed relationship. As mentioned previously, the relationship between the two tables is based on the project ID attribute. Now that the schema is complete, the View Designer tool is used to build the desired virtual view. The first step is to load the schema file. The first node in the virtual view is modeled on the project table. For this node, the project-related attributes are declared for the virtual entries. The RDN for the project entries can be modified to display the project name in the virtual tree. Next, a sublevel is added into the view definition and it is based on the people table. The relationship between the two tables is used as the basis for building the hierarchy. Attributes related to the people are defined for the virtual entries. Once the virtual view is complete, the view file is saved. Finally, the runtime preview is used to display the virtual view. The hierarchy is based on projects, and below each project is a list of people who are associated with the project. This concludes the video demonstrating how the Radiant One VDS can be used to build a hierarchical virtual view based on relationships existing in a database.